On the dynamic core interlock page, the user can see all interlocks related to core movements, and also enable bypass signals when needed. Let's look at a few examples, to explain the use of the page. On the core setup page, we have set core 1, as shown on the left. The core should move in after clamp closes, and move out after clamp opens. On the dynamic core interlock page, we can see exactly these program settings in the following columns. On the left, we have the axis column, with 10 cores, clamp, ejector and injection. Next, for each axis, except injection, we have two rows for positive and negative direction of movement. For core 1, these are the in and out movements. The next three columns are related to interlock conditions. Here, the user can see to which axis, condition, and position the core is interlocked. In our case, based on core 1 programming, the core cannot move inward unless the clamp is in negative stop position, at 0 mm, and, it can't move outward unless the clamp is in positive stop position, at 1000 mm. Comparing this to program 1, it means core 1 can move inward after clamp is closed, and it can move outward after clamp opens. All the way to the right, we have the bypass buttons. If it's required to move the axis when interlock conditions are not fulfilled, the user can activate the bypass button, and move the axis manually. We can also see now, that in the clamp axis an interlock is active, and if we try to open the clamp, we would get an alarm, because the core 1 is not in position. Now we could either move core 1 inward, or we can bypass the clamp open movement. The same principles apply to the rest of axis movements. All the way on the bottom of the page, is a set of indicators, to showcase the core status. It can show if the core is moving in or out, or indicate in which end position it is. We hope this video tutorial was helpful. If you have any other questions regarding core interlock page, please leave a comment below, or contact us directly through our customer service channels. Thank you, and have a nice day.